All right, man. I, it's been a minute since I've sat down and spoken about Borussia Dortmund on my channel, considering I am a Dortmund fan. And I know a lot of you are expecting me to rant about the result that's taken place. But truthfully, I'm not that angry because I expected this. Whenever you put Dortmund in a must-win game, 90% of the time they're going to lose. And this has been a common theme for years. We just cannot seem to get the job done when you put us in a game where we need to win. So looking at where we are right now, where our performances are very still inconsistent, you know, there are games where I feel like we should be dominating and we're not, e.g. this past weekend against Stuttgart where we got two lucky goals. Yes, they were very lucky goals, uh, goals that we needed and a game that we needed to win considering Bayern Munich dropped points, but still, we got away with it, do you know what I mean? With the amount of injuries we've also got as well, going into this game against Sporting who are running rampant right now in Liga Nos. They are top of the table level points with Porto as well. This is going to be a tricky game. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people are looking at this for face value. A lot of people are looking at this uh, via the team sheet. But you have to look at it by form. You have to look at it by consistent performances. And right now, Dortmund's performances while we are winning games um, is still very inconsistent versus Sporting who are getting consistent results, top of their table, cleaning house, doing what they need to do. Um, we are now in the Europa League. We are now in the Europa League. Is that bad? No, because this is a competition that I feel like we can win. When we get our full strength squad, uh, I feel like we are capable of actually doing the full madness in this competition. What this does is it impacts our chances of keeping Haaland. Haaland is not a Europa League footballer, you know what I'm saying? Jadon Sancho, if he was still here, is not a Europa League footballer. Some of the star players, Bellingham, he is not a Europa League footballer. You get me? Like, we are not trying to have this image where we're going to constantly be knocked out in the Champions League and go into the Europa League. That's not the image we want to try and portray. You know, we want to try and show Erling Haaland, Marlon, uh, Bellingham, that we are capable of getting consistent Champions League football every season via the Bundesliga. And while we're in those competitions, we can go as far as possible, meaning quarterfinals at least. This ain't good enough, you know what I'm saying? This is really not good enough being in the Europa League with the players that we are trying to keep hold of. You know what I'm saying? Like, Bellingham is going to look at this situation, especially if we don't qualify in the Champions League in the Bundesliga, which I think is very unlikely because the title race is pretty much neck and neck. Now we're a point behind Bayern Munich. Um, we are going to qualify for Champions League 100%, but it, it gives him that impression of, OK, what if this happens again next season? I don't want to be playing in the Europa League. I want to play for a team, e.g. like Liverpool, who have cleaned house their entire group stage. You know what I'm saying? Um, <clears throat> Chelsea have cleaned house all of these teams that are attracted uh, to Bellingham are cleaning house and we're just here struggling to get out of a group that ideally really wasn't that difficult but Shiktas really weren't that difficult Sporting on their day can be problematic but again really not that difficult the only team that was a problem in this group was Ajax and they proved it because they just destroyed everyone <laughs> they destroyed every single team in our group so rightfully so they deserve to go through and I hope that they do a madness just like they did in the um, I believe it was the 18-19 season when they had the lick Donny van der Beek and Frankie de Jong they deserve to be doing a madness you know what I'm saying uh, where we go from here is, you know, we just have to literally keep our heads up and actually try and take this Europa League competition by storm. It's not good enough to just, you know, oh, yeah, we're in the Europa League, we can relax a bit. Nah, foot on their necks, man. You get me? RKO, stunners, DDTs off the table and that. We need to go mad in this, in this Europa League. I want to win it. I'm looking at this competition like I want to win. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't want to look at this competition and, and feel nervous. Like, when we get our full squad back, I want to win this competition. End of. I think that's the, the only real um, goal for me this season. You know what I'm saying? The, the league is the league. If we win it, we, that would be amazing. Especially for players like Marco Royce. That would be fantastic. But if we don't win it, cool. But the Europa League is achievable. We can win that. You know what I'm saying? We just need to get our stuff together. You get me? Um, but yeah, it's what it is, man. Like I said, man, these, these results, they usually happen for Dortmund. Like, must win games, we don't win them. It just, it just is what it is, man. Um, I'm actually in the process of recording a video for Friday, so that's why there's no webcam, because I just wanted to sit down and talk about it. But yeah, if you want me to do more Borussia Dortmund videos, um, past and current, future, 
you know, talking about the history, talking about news in Dortmund, talking about Dortmund games, doing watch-alongs for Dortmund games, uh, let me know in the comment section down below. Um, I'll catch you guys very, very soon. Take care of yourselves. It's an L. Yeah, you lot can rip me on Twitter. I don't give a heck. You can all suck my kneecap in a bit. Here to give you the exclusive. I've teamed up with Team Command and my pro team to give you guys the best deals on some of the best gaming energy drinks on the market. Filled with minerals, filled with vitamins and caffeine, all for your gaming purposes. All you got to do is head over to the link in the description, find what you want, scroll through, look through the beverages. Yeah, sour apple, berry, strawberry, all flavours, drinks and that, flavour and that, get me fruits and that. Head over to the basket and use the code W3Y to save 52% off. Let me repeat one more time. 52% off all for this week for Black Friday. Make sure you head over to the link in the description and find your flavours today. Get me. I command. <laughs> you know? Stop. Bruh. All right, in a bit, man.